Greetings, Aziz the Sacred Wellspring of Sacred Sister Soul Talks TV talking to you today about the Lionsgate portal that opened at 12 a.m. on 8 8. That would be today. I am wearing my headdress, it is made of copper, selenite crystals, as well as clear quartz. Let's talk about the Lionsgate portal. It is represented, uh, represented as a symbol of completion and balance. It is a completion of one cycle coming from the Piscean age into the Aquarian age of knowing. This is the age of to know. You're not guessing, you're not hoping, you either know or you don't know. It represents stability, forgiveness, generosity, prosperity, and love. The Lion's Gate portal open on 8 8 at 12 a.m this portal opens up every year between the constellations of leo and virgo these are two different constellations in the cosmos the stargate portal is an opportunity to manifest and make things happen we can use this energy to help us manifest our goals and bring them into reality it is an unstoppable flow of positive energy that will transform the lives of those who are ready to receive it. So by now you would have done all of your shadow work or most of your shadow work and you're getting ready now to receive that energy. This energy will only come in to help you transform and become your best self or towards your best self. August 8th is when the earth, Sirius, the sun in Leo, Orion's belt, the three kings, are all in alignment. This brings a healing and a renewing of power. This is especially beautiful this time as the earth is in a full shift mode and there is a transition of power on all levels. This energy opens your heart chakra, allowing authentic love from source to flow. If there are old wounds of the heart that need healing, this is a great time to do so. This is where your shadow work comes into play. This portal also opens up your higher chakras as well as your minor chakras. This will help you to tap into your higher spiritual knowledge, connect you to your higher wisdom, intuition, and guidance. It helps you to access your ancestral knowledge and develop an innate ability to access the realms of consciousness. This portal helps you to connect to your third eye chakra, which connects you to source. Source is what people call God. This allows greater communication with your spirit guides, who will give you a message so that you can either understand what is happening at this time or help you to transition and transform your being. These messages may come in different forms. They may come in dreams. They may come in visions. They may come in animal companions or, med or mediums that help you to interpret the messages. So today, pay especially close attention. Your spirit guides guide you all along the way. But today, it op this portal opens up so that your ancestral, your ancestors or your spirit guides or your soul groups can send you additional messages because it comes through the photon belt even quicker today. So you are going to get these visions. You're, get, you're going to get a sense of knowing. I think last year people call it getting into your superpower. You're going to connect even greater and higher with this portal. It transitions and it pushes us even higher to do better, to become better. As a people of color, this is especially important for us because we are transitioning from an old system into a newer system. We are talking about pole shift. People keep talking about the pole shift, but you, you need to understand what that means at this stage. The pole shift is Cepheus constellation will become the new pole star and that is in transition. That never stops. It just pushes it to there, pushes it a little bit closer. Uh, the best way I can explain it is remember Star Trek when um, Captain Picard was said um, go to hyperspeed that's what we're going through as Earth merges with herself Tara she is going home into 5D so when we had the eclipse moon and I believe it was in May um, her oversoul was there so Earth is actually merging with herself so she is out going home to meet her groom which is Anubis she's going home to Sirius 
So the best way to benefit from this portal is to practice gratitude. And we should be practicing gratitude no matter what. But today is a great day to do that. And when you practice gratitude, come from a place of intention. Don't do something and say, oh, I shouldn't have done it. If you're going to do it, do it from a place of intention. And that makes the, the gratitude even more sweeter, as we would say. Practice gratitude which prepares you for receiving higher energies. Do some visualizing. Um, this strengthens your determination to achieving your goals. And engage in the 369 method. There are different ways and different methods people use when it comes to 369. But you do the 369 method. The, this method helps you to manifest and achieve your goals and desires even greater. So you choose three affirmations that you want to make happen. Then you write those, tra those tra um, oh, sorry, affirmations six times, and then you visualize that for nine seconds. That will help. What I did this morning, I got up about 5.30, and I went into a state of meditation because I was feeling that from yesterday. I have weeks now, but it was preparing me for today. So I went into a state of meditation, and... Um, I'm not going to tell you what the divine showed me, but it calmed my spirit and relaxed me. And I could feel her energy as she rests her hand on my, my chest, on my thymus gland. I could feel that energy radiating powerful energy. And how I choose to use that energy, I sent it into the world to heal the world. That was my form of gratitude given to the world. So, um... I hope today you do some meditations and bring in some positive energies. Um, join us on Saturday or in your area, wherever you are. If you're by yourself, you have a group of friends or just your husband or daughters or what have you. On Saturday, August 13th at 9 a.m., you just manifest what you want to see happen for the world, for yourself, for your family. And let's do this collectively. Once we do this collectively, it changes the dynamic of our environment and it changes it for the better so with that said happy manifesting see you soon